Hello everybody, um, this is my first channel I, and I hope you gain a blessing from it. Um, my channel is the preacher in poetry and song but I'll be doing a testimony about camp meeting and what happened because I'm actually self-employed, I'm actually a photographer, I'm JJD Photography and um, the thing is I wanted to promote myself, I wanted to go to people and show my work and things like that but I didn't want to go the way how you go up and show your work and present it to them and give them the card. I wanted something different than that. I want something original, if you understand what I'm saying. Um, my support worker told me to actually put it, put it in a portfolio to actually present my work to people and give me, give the business, the business cards but the thing was I found it really hard so I'm gonna go back and tell you the story I'm not gonna go all into it I'm just gonna go on parts of it so the support worker was telling me to go and present my work to people and I said no nah, I can't do that there's no confidence, no no confidence in me. I couldn't even go to people, I couldn't even do this, I couldn't do that. Um, so one day, it was, I forgot which day it was, but it was on probably, I'll probably say Wednesday, Thursday. All right, um, I prayed and I prayed for confidence. And the thing was, I always send these people these um, devotional um, messages every day and when I start to read it, it said the same thing what I prayed for, for confidence, God will give you confidence and there was a text saying be strong, um, fear not. Um, I can't remember the whole thing but I will go back and probably next time if I say it again or if I do another testimony I will show you that that text but I just started to cry because I knew that God will help me it will help me so much so I prayed again and then I had my breakfast and then I went out with my portfolio and I said I'm gonna do this so I went to the library and I went in the library and I went in and I saw pure men. I said, nah, there's no one here. You know, men don't want their pictures taken. They're like, you know, they're boring. I'm, I'm, I'm very sorry to say that, but they're very boring and they need to open up and you need to, you know, you know, express yourself to the, you know, to, you know, more, you know, if you understand what I'm saying. Anyway, so I was looking around, looking around, right, and I said, no, nah, I'm, I'm going, I'm going. So I saw this young lady, and she was just there. I'm like, okay, I found myself, I could not go up to that person. I couldn't go straight up to her and say, oh, I'm a photographer, I'm doing, doing this and that. I couldn't, I couldn't actually do that. So I was circling around, there was like lots of leaflets around, there was leaflets all over the place. I was looking around, I was praying and saying, God, I don't, can't do this. And it says confidence and be strong and and God will take away my fear. I'm like, okay. So I did pray about it, I did talk to him and he did give me that promise. So I went up, I went up and uh, I went round, I went right round the, the library, the, uh, she was still there. And then I went up to her because I said, I'm going to try this. So I said to her, I'm going to try. I am going to show you my work because I'm a photographer. And she said, yeah, 
Yeah, she wanted to see the work, so she saw the work, she really loved the work. And um, I said to her, do you want a business card? And she said, yeah. She said, can I have two more for my friends? I said, sure. So I felt blessed in what God was doing in my life. But then again, that wasn't enough. That was only one person. So I went to House of Fraser and I went in and this lady smiled at me. She was assistant. She was putting buttons in, in, a, um, in a tin or something like that. And I never hesitated to go up. I said, it's like, I feel like I can't do this, you know, but I prayed about it. I really prayed about it. I saw God's promise in the Bible and his Bible, it, the, the words, the words, the words were true because God is true. God is, God is faithful and merciful and, and just and whatever, you know, and I didn't go up to her. I went upstairs to look at clothes and things like that. Then I saw my friend from church. We talked for ages, probably an hour and a half, talking. Then I went upstairs, looked some clothes, and I went back downstairs, and the lady was still there. So I went up to her and I said, I'm not buying anything. Um, can I show you my work? And she said, sure. And I showed her my work and she said, can I have one of your business cards? I said, yeah. So I said to her, how did I do? She said, that was lovely. You should promote more often. Um, she encouraged me so much. It was, it was so, it was, I was so blessed in what she said to me. And I, and I thank God for praying for that devotion and that Bible text to help me. But then there was something going on. I was like, how can I do this properly? How can I deliver? Camp meeting was coming up and um, I needed something to go by. So somebody um, at the gallery, because I had my work um, displayed at the gallery um, for a month, for my, my pictures, what I did in Low Hill project because Low Hill is not an attractive place but it's it's good when I took pictures of it because I made it look attractive in pictures so I actually this guy helped me do project so I didn't know what project he was talking about so I looked on the internet and I saw these projects and I was like this is interesting uh, I saw photo walk I saw um, 100 strangers I saw um, take pictures of shoes all sorts of projects so 100 strangers was one this was so interesting and photo walk I did photo walk before but I, I didn't do it in a twist you know in a way so I made up my mind and said I'm doing a hundred strangers I'm taking pictures in black and white and I'm doing a photo walk so I prepared myself for camp meeting I prayed I told God what I'm gonna to say to people what I'm gonna do I am gonna do this a hundred strangers thing and and I said this is it, this is going to be full on. I'm going to do this till the end and I will get that 100 strangers. I prayed and I said that this is my business now, I need to do this. And the thing was, it was on my mind how to do this, how to complete it, how to talk to people and things like that. So camp meeting came along. I was ready. I had all my stuff ready. And Monday, I was waiting to go in my chalet. I was tired and all that, but I wanted to do it so bad on Monday. 
I knew that I didn't have my share there. I was sitting down, waiting. Everybody was waiting and all that. My folder was in my bag. And I said, I said, I said, my plan, my plan was on Monday, target people right now, right? And I was there. Nah, man, this is not how my plan was going. I wasn't targeting no one because people were waiting for their chalets to, to go in and settle down and put their, their luggage in their chalets and things like that. So my mind said, I'm taking it out. I'm taking my folder out. I'm going to show people. So I showed about one. I was, I was disappointed. I was very disappointed. Uh, and I showed one and said, I told her what I was doing, but my camera wasn't there. My camera was not ready to do because I was so tired. So I told myself, I'm doing it Tuesday. Tuesday, I started it and it was such a blessing that how I went up to them with confidence, going to everyone, to different people who I never met before. I never met them. I didn't even know who they were. And some of them said, yeah, this is interesting. And I told them, I said that I'm um, Jason, I'm from Wolverhampton Central, and um, I'm doing a product called 100 Strangers. And I, I told them, what it was about and it was good it was so good i was blessed I, my confidence raised up so high i couldn't believe it god was helping me so much i prayed i prayed but the thing was i i also did the photo walk.